So my God, it's CJ.com. Hey guys, this is Quentin Jeff from ZomeGodCJ.com, and we're just gonna take you on a quick tour of the Android market. All right, so now when you first start up the Android market, um, this is what you see. Um, there are three divisions, which are basically Android uh, applications, uh, games, and downloads. Um, there's also a featured list of the um, latest, um, you know applications right there. Uh, you might have seen there that if you have already installed an application, it'll tell you that you've already installed it right there. Um, you can tap on an application to open it up. Uh, I'm on Edge right now, so it might be a little bit slow, but you can also see uh, the screenshots uh, right there. Um, so you can just tap on a screenshot and look at how the application will look on your phone when you install it. Um, like I said, I'm on Edge on GPRS right now, so it might take a little while. Uh, so yeah, so that's how it would look on your phone. That's something very cool about the um, screenshots. They are proper full, full resolution screenshots for your um, Android phone. Um, there's also a bit of reviews right there, uh, more about the developer. Um, or you can send an email to a developer or view more applications by the developer, um, stuff like that. Um, these are all free applications, as you can see. There's also paid content. And if one of your applications has an update available, it will notify you right there. Um, now, let me just show you an example of um, how to install an application. For example, if I were to install Google Shopper right there, I just tap on that. Um, I just tap on Install. It will notify you that these are the security options that um, the application will have access to. Click OK and that's about it. Your application is now downloading in the background. So there's nothing much to worry about. Um, in the meanwhile you can browse the rest of the store, you can browse the applications uh, category um, which is sorted by types of applications as you can see right there are a lot of different types. Um, there's also the uh, let me go back, there's also the games category which has a whole bunch of games, again, sorted by type of games, uh, for example, all games. Um, you can also sort any apps or games by the top three games or the most recently listed games in there. So that'll take a little while to load, but uh, you get the picture. Um, downloads is the section where uh, it lists all the apps that you have downloaded and installed on your Android phone. Um, this, this section also tells you if you have any updates for the applications available or something else. Um, again, I'm on GPRS, so it might take a little while to load, but uh, there you go. So that's what you're currently downloading right there. Um, these are the downloads that are already installed on your phone that have updates available for them. Um, and these are the applications that you have installed on your phone. Uh, so yeah, that's pretty cool. You can also um, tap on an application and choose to uninstall it or open it right from here. Um, or you can choose to update um, any application that has an update available for it. So yeah, that's pretty cool. You can also choose to um, review the application from here if you choose to. So yeah, um, you can also view what you're currently downloading and choose to cancel the download right there. Um, that's pretty cool. So yeah, um, that's basically how the Android Marketplace works. Uh, you can also search for an application if you know the name. Um, for example, if I were to type Google. So there you see the results for Google. There's a 1137 results right there that you can keep on scrolling through. Um, one cool thing though is that as you scroll through the list, it um, loads new apps at the bottom, so you can basically keep on scrolling through the list without having to go to the next page or anything like that. So that's something very cool. Um, and again, these are all um, applications with the term Google on them. Um, the search, the search um, list over there also keeps a track of any um, of your previous searches. Um, like for example, these are things that I have searched for before. So yeah, this is pretty cool. It keeps a history of your searches also, um, just in case you want to look for something that you already had. Um, at the same time, there's a little featured um, 
ad thing kind of banner right here that keeps on switching to um, its best uh, browsers or social applications, etc. Um, and the Android notification bar also tells you if um, an installation of an ongoing application is uh, going on there. Just so you know if the um, application is downloading or not. So yeah, that's basically how to download an application and um, install it on your Android phone. Very easy. The Android Marketplace has a lot of applications as you can see right there. Um, for more details on this, do check out our post on zomaigodacj.com. If you have any questions or comments, do let us know in the comment section below.